So, so von Hippel-Landau disease is a, is a condition that's inherited uh, in an autosomal dom dominant fashion. Affected individuals have uh, an increased risk of developing a variety of cancers in, a multiple, in multiple organs. Um, for instance, they develop bilateral multifocal clear cell kidney cancer, as well as renal cysts uh, that affect both, both kidneys. Uh, they can develop uh, pancreatic neuroendocrine tumors uh, in, 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 in the pancreas, along with pancreatic cysts, as well as cystic adenomas in the pancreas. Uh, they can develop pheochromocytomas, uh, and, uh, and paragangliomas. Uh, and these are all tumors that have malignant potential uh, uh, as well. Uh, in addition to these tumors, they can also develop uh, a, a variety of other tumors that don't have malignant potential in the sense that they don't metastasize, but are nonetheless a source of significant morbidity uh, to these patients. And these include uh, hemangioblastomas, abnormal vascular uh, in the tumors, arising in the brain and the spine uh, as well as in the in the in the, in the, reti in, in the retina so these are all hemangioblastomas that arise in these in these various uh, in these various uh, locations uh, people also develop a very rare and unusual tumor in the endolymphatic sac uh, called the endolymphatic sac tumor uh, as well as cystic adenomas in the testes in men and in the broad ligament uh, in women, women. Uh, so this is some of the manifestations of uh, of, of VHL, uh, approximately 60 to 70% of the patients uh, with VHL tend to develop uh, uh, clear cell kidney cancer uh, uh, and uh, uh, varying proportions uh, of uh, patients develop other manifestations of, uh, of VHL.